What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bogus, back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video. Yo, 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 what is going on, dudes? What's going on, people? Um, Today, it's going to be a prediction video. I have some information to tell you guys. I don't know if it's accurate, but I'm pretty sure that what I'm going to say right now might happen tomorrow and what you guys should know about tomorrow. So let's get into it before we get into the video. Be sure to hit that like button, drop the sub, because, um, guys, you drop anything in the comments, and you have a chance of winning 10k MT if the video hits 30 likes, so make sure to drop those likes, and uh, let's get into it. So, what I noticed um, is that every Friday, 2k usually drops content, and these packs are leaving in 17 hours. What makes me think? So, 2k usually drops packs Fridays, and these packs are expiring Friday. Yes, they did drop these and these. But I feel like there's going to be more packs. And also, I'm going to give my explanation on why is that. So let's go over here and let's look at these mystery players. I don't know if you guys know about these mystery players. Let's see if we can find them. Yeah, so right here. So Legacy Showcase. Now, maybe this is a Tuesday or a Monday collection whenever they drop those Earl of Pearls. I believe it was a Tuesday. So maybe every Tuesday they'll drop new packs for this. But... If they don't, it might drop tomorrow. And now, if this drops tomorrow, there's going to be a lot of things we could talk about in the auction. Um, there's a lot of things we be talking about to make MT and all that good stuff. So, but anyways, let me try to dissect this through. So, they got a mystery player here. And maybe they also drop a new spotlight challenge. So, alright. So, this is what I'm thinking. So, wait. One of these packs expire. Let's check. These packs are gone in three days. So, it looks like... My predictions are right. It looks like every Tuesday they'll drop these packs. And it looks like every other two weeks they'll drop the Spotlight Series 2. So now my theory here is so if they're dropping the Spotlight Series 2 tomorrow, which honestly I'm about 80% sure they will, what happens? So this Spotlight Challenge, if you guys have not checked it out, um, it's pretty good. You get a diamond Alonzo Morning. You do have to have the whole collection in, the, in your binder. But other than that, uh, what's gonna happen a market crash is gonna happen once again the market will crash again And also since they'll be out of packs tomorrow if you have some mellows Michael Beasley's whoever's in this collection You're gonna make some MT because they're gonna go up a lot just because people are gonna try to do these and there's not a lot of duh, What's it called? There's not a lot of supply of them anymore So demand's gonna go up higher and supply is definitely gonna drop meaning you'll make a ton of MT if you have the cards Unfortunately, I sold my mellow for about 120k uh, let's check out what he's out. I know a lot of people are keeping their Carmelo Anthony. So I want to tell you guys what you should sell him at. I sold mine at 120k bid. So yeah, as you guys can see, he's no longer up for buy now. And there's a slim, slim amount of him. So if you have Melo, uh, congratulations. You're going to make a ton of profit. I sniped him for 64k and I sold him for 120. Um, that profit margin is crazy. Also, so... If they drop a spotlight challenge, that means they're going to drop something cool. They're going to drop new challenges, um, which is probably going to be a free diamond, maybe even a free pink diamond. Maybe it'll be 18 challenges instead of 17, but if they have a spotlight series one on it, clearly there's going to be a different series that's going to drop. So if they do drop a different series, what is that? Like, it's just going to help us if anything. The market's going to crash. Um, you're going to make a ton of MT. And pretty much you're just going to like the game a lot more. Pretty much you're just going to grind a game, get off, snipe, sell some cards, get back on the grind. And that's what I do constantly. So now, what do I think is going to drop? So now, they have a, a Spotlight D-Wade. He is retired. Um, possibly they have a Spotlight Dirk or T-Mac or any of those dudes that um, are in the, what's it called? The five starter players. Maybe. I don't know. I could be off. Um, so, like, they'd have a Derrick Rose point guard. He's not retired, but they have a uh, Tracy shooting guard, a small forward of Vince Carter. Maybe they drop spotlights like that. I don't know, though. I do not know. A spotlight D-Wade. I can't really think of what other predictions they could drop. If you guys have any other predictions on what they could drop, let me know. Maybe an AD. I don't know. Spotlight D uh, AD. Maybe a spotlight, I don't know, who retired. Maybe a Tim Duncan. They already dropped a Tim Duncan. So, I don't know. Um, we'll see what they're dropped. But also, what I want to talk about is what happened to the auction today. So, 
Dude, the auction, it's just, it always dies. It, it keeps dying every day, and I don't know what to do anymore. I literally can't hold on to cards. I have to sell everything again. So, last night, um, I just saw the auction was down a lot, but today it's down again because they have five packs, like, out, and that's just not good. All right, yeah, Yon says 65, which is actually a little bit expensive. Harden, all right. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell my Yon at 69K. Uh, I'm going to sell my Bobby Jones. I'm going to sell everybody I got because I know for a fact everything's going to come crashing down tomorrow when they drop packs on Friday. If you guys are home from school tomorrow, get ready because a market crash is coming. I'm not predicting it. I know for a fact the market crash is coming. Whatever they, whatever they drop, dude, I'm telling you right now, if they drop anything, the market crashes no matter what, 2K. Every single pack they dropped, Amethyst has went down. Rubies have went down. There's just too many cards flooding the auction, and I'm telling you, believe me, I just know. Um, let's check out Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones was about 9K yesterday. Maybe he went up, hopefully. Oh my goodness, he's even cheaper than 9K. So that is a perfect example. Bobby Jones has went down even more. I got him for 9K. It looks like he's about 9K. Let's see, Bobby Jones, Amethyst. I think the auction's just lagging. All right, nine eight, yeah. It looks like it's just lagging. Nine 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 five, nine k. So one just got posted for nine k. An amethyst ninety overall is nine k. How broken is that? Harden was sixty k the other day, forty k today. Every day cards keep dropping. And what? What is? Why? Why do they keep dropping? Because they drop packs. They drop three. They're gonna drop three sets of packs this week. Think about that. What they drop Tuesday? Uh, what they drop a pack Saturday, Tuesday, and Friday. So just think about that. Um, that's a crazy amount of packs. Maybe 2K will slow down the packs. I don't know. But if they keep dropping packs, we're just going to have to keep on selling teams every day because you're just going to lose a ton. A whole lot of MT. And honestly, I don't want to lose MT. I can't stand losing MT. It's terrible. It's so terrible. So Bobby Jones at 9K. Where the hell is this card? I have no idea. All right. So what do I think is going to happen now? Um, for, for sure, these packs are going to drop and I'm going to show you some prices where I think you guys should either sell or buy right now. I would just say sell, but I'm going to predict some prices. So a Giannis at 65 K I say he goes to 56 K with those packs dropping, uh, Steph Curry. Um, let's see. Steph Curry's at 54 about 54k for a Steph Curry. So my predictions, he's going under 50. He's gonna be like 48, 47. Um, so that's the price for Curry. Harden's at 40k. Harden's gotta be running around 35k tomorrow. Uh, let's check out Anthony Davis. We go by a bunch of Amethysts because first of all, Amethysts are just like the key. If you could tell the auctions dropping by Amethyst prices, because they're the highest overall cards besides that one diamond. You always gotta you always gotta check their prices, especially when you have a ton of MT like me. Um, you always got to monitor their freaking prices because you don't you'll know so for instance this ad is at 48 he'll probably drop to 42 tomorrow uh it'll be a good time to pick him up around like an hour or 30 minutes after the packs drop and honestly i'm not guaranteeing packs i really do think packs are going to drop i'm almost certain they have a spotlight series challenge they have mystery players in the game they have alonzo morning and then it says that mystery players so that means they gotta drop something tomorrow. It's gotta be spotlights. It really can't be anything else. I'm pretty almost guaranteeing they'll drop spotlights tomorrow. So, with that said, um, Amethyst, if you got me Amethyst, make sure to sell. I'll be dropping this vid a little early, probably around 10:30, um, so you could just sell all your cards and make that MT. Um, yeah, in this video, I'm telling you, I have my Harden up here for 41. I'm gonna sell my other Harden for 40. In this video, I'm pretty much just telling you guys, sell your cards, get ready, baby. Contest dropping tomorrow. I want you guys to stay prepared like me. Uh, make that MT, snipe tomorrow, enjoy. If you guys have any snipe problems, like I'm dropping a snipe filter in a, uh, right after this video, probably around like one o'clock. So if you guys enjoy the snipe filter and know any snipe filters that, that would help me, just let me know in the comments down below. Um, and honestly, that's all I really got. Just make sure you sell your amethyst. Make sure you watch these market videos. Make sure you tell your friends, tell your family that are posting every single day two times. So, yeah, guys, that's all I really got. I hope you enjoyed. Um, thank you guys for coming out. Have a good one, guys. Peace.